Do nah, that. I'll do that after I get my butt kicked my character a few times. That's important to learn for like a couple things, like what's plus, what's negative, you know, and like the actual frame advantage, like what can I beat out mm -hmm. with what. But as far as it goes, like as to play the neutral, you can't learn that online. No, oh, yeah. You can learn tips and tricks and tricks and tips, but you gotta go get your butt kicked. All right, folks. So the moment you've all been waiting for, we are in grand finals. I gotta wonder who beat Hipster. That's a very good question, because from what I've seen his gameplay, he's been doing phenomenal. Well. Yeah, or at the very least, confusing everybody into victory. Right, yeah. Oh, interesting. So it turns out it looks like Bato actually beat Hitster. Yeah. All right. Yeah, hey, that was real good. Faked the landing in order to just throw the laser out. That is a forward back charge, so that's a little bit harder to like uh, uh, disguise. So this oh, is, bounce. So this is definitely going to be an interesting match here, to say the least. We have Batista, who's a very nice long range zoner character. And we have oh, Chaos. No. Ooh, you, at least you got the persona away, but mm -hmm. man. And we have Chaos, who is the puppet master that can hit yeah. you from like full screen away. So to see how these individuals will counteract each other in this matchup is going to be a spectacle to behold. And don't forget that Hitster is coming from loser's bracket. Ooh. Hitcher's coming from loser's bracket, so uh, he's got to win not only three games, but two sets of three games. Yep. Where's Como Lancet? One. So right now, it's definitely looking Como's favor right now. He's definitely going into this match mentally prepared. Yeah. Mentally, I guess. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we did see him just go down one, so let's see if he's able to adapt. Very nice grid break. Very nice. Wait. Bato beat Hitster and then lost to Drellin? That, that That's why my mind was blown. I was just like, how? <laughs> Wait a minute. No wonder he was so salty. <laughs> You're like, man, I just beat a Chaos player and now I lost a, a different one. This sucks. Oh, man. Yeah, okay, that makes sense. That, that explains the salt. He, he refused the handshake. He did all that stuff. Nonsense. Okay, I got it. Oh, very nice dash save from, from Koma. Oh, gets, gets the grid break grab. Putting Chaos in a very not so pleasable spot and down. And he's going in with 200 meter. Let's see if he decides to spend it. <laughs> <laughs> don't know. Koma, uh, we could say, had a little problem with knowing how to spend meter. He would just sit on it all game. Mm. Let's see if he decides to do anything. And again, don't make that oh. hash. Don't make that hashtag. No picking make on that hashtag. Hair. Go ahead, pick on Coma. No, 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 we're not. No, we're, they're, they're saying Spend we're picking on meter. They're saying we're picking on Drayla still, and I was like, oh. we're not. We're not. I promise, we're not. Oh, that. Oh, that Chimera Dragon-looking thing is definitely gonna be just the, the thorn in his side right now. It's actually been the thorn in everyone's side of this tournament tonight. Some of the bots, Give, give, and, give and take for Vato. He had his win and then yeah, he had yeah, just... It, it literally give and take. <laughs> Beat one, lost one. All right, whatever. <laughs> All right, and right now it's one to zero. Yeah. H, uh, hipster, hipster leading slavery. right now. Hipster doing some good old things out here. <laughs> you can see Batista just trying to like knock mm. that thing away. Just trying to get oh him out. God. Yeah, don't. You, you can't you jump. jump. Not jump. Hitster has the reactions to make his persona DP wherever it's close to you. At least you get kind of free range now because uh, persona's gone, so it's gonna spawn next to him. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Very nice dash and attack with the spinning blades of death. Very nice to open them up. And then B and Bs. We got a couple of those. A right, very nice change shift right after the push block to try and get into convert off that. Very nice play from Hipster. But watch that persona. It is on top of you. It is on your butt. Nice jump over that and the 6C. I'm going to go ahead and call it a 6C until I figure out if it's 4 or 6. All right. You seen some nice, nice reactions from Nice spacing. You saw that? Yes, I did. Backdash those. Reflectors. Fine, reflectors. I won't call them push blocks. I'll call, <laughs> I'll call them reflectors, guys. Be 
Some of the fire alarm? What was that? Don't, oh. don't, don't say that. It's, it's, it's probably still raining outside. No, oh, God. Oh, man. That, that sucks. Like the last time they pulled the fire alarm, and he had to go outside. Yeah. Yeah. That was terrible. It was cold. Oh, and Batista wins. But yeah. So pretty much what Coma's going to have to do in all honesty <laughs> Are you is... Are say he's got to time his opponent Just out? time his opponent out. Um, I will say, though, that we have seen that, and I, I know for a fact that Coma keeps his eye like all over the screen. Yes. He knows when the timeout's coming mm -hmm. up. We've seen him do things like uh, uh, charge the bail off. Mm -hmm. We've seen him just hold back. And even then, I you can see that Como really wasn't that panicked just by getting hit because he said, all right, I, I know. You're not going to do that much damage to me. Okay. Nice. Oh, that was a nice change shift, but with the persona still there in space. Hit. I'm surprised you got hit. You should have just chain shift and block. You'd be able to tell that one what side of your opponent was. Okay. And cool. At the very least, we're picking up the combos. Mm -hmm. so we're knocking out, uh, knocking out the persona by way of body and chaos. And you go with the very so, nice grab with the wall bounce. Yeah. Still applying that pressure. Batista oh. says, "I can go. I can dash through people too." And mine has an attack behind it. All right, we got Hipster with the veil off, able to summon his persona back on board. Let's see what he does right now. He continues to apply the pressure to Koma in the corner, hits him with the reflector, goes the overhead, got back and forth, and, and then finishes off. That, that hurt a lot. Yeah, if you get shield broken, thrown, like, man, that's pain. I got some more cross-up action. He's got to remember that he if that if that thing is on top of him, you literally can't press yeah. the button because we've seen and like you said, wait till it goes away. Hip, yeah, wait till it goes away because hipster has that there reaction that whenever you do something and that persona's on top of you, you're, he's going to hit you with that. Right. Not to mention the fact that it's by you for a reason. It's probably mm -hmm. already attacked. <laughs> See, they're already attacking, or it's waiting for you to jump so it can just DP you. Mm -hmm. That was pretty cool. Oh, if you would have got the convert off that, I would have just popped up. Oh my goodness. That was a really cool attack, though. It was like a you know, dive block. Yeah. Ooh, that was nice. Both and, them oh, drop the combo, though. Now your chance. That's what we're going to do. He's gonna watch, out for, watch out for those mix ups, and he gets hit with the overhead. Uh, just like that. 2 0, and Koma's really got a thing. Call Vato into your corner. Vato beat this man. Yeah, like, like Vato, go over here and talk to my man. Give my man some milk real quick. Give him some pointers on oh something no. what he can Where's do. Where's Vato? Oh no, he's got his AirPods in. He can't hear us. Oh have no. You seen, have you seen that meme? Which one? The, the he's got. Oh no, he's got his headphones in. He can't hear us. It was like Squidward. He's like Squidward. Like Squidward. What are you doing in the middle of the road? You're gonna get hit by a bus. Squidward. Oh no, he's he can't hear us. <laughs> he's got his headphones on. <laughs> it's like memes are so weird now. Like, what kind of sense does that make? Okay, we, we will start calling the lizard by his name. The lizard's name is Azki. Persona, got it. <laughs> <laughs> Poor weird dog, actually. Gotcha. <laughs> oh, okay, so so Koma's switching it up now. He's uh, going up with Batista, and he's going with Elton now. So let's see what he can do with this. Mm. Yeah, Koma does play Elton. Oh, okay. <laughs> he just kicks that dog in the head. You saw that? Mm -hmm. um, yeah, Eldenum has full screen projectiles that are very quick, and some of them even take very strange paths around. So if I had to guess, I think that Koma's plan here is going to be to try to um, is going to be to try to shoot chaos mm -hmm. to make sure that he doesn't actually to make the persona go away. That being said, it doesn't really kind of solve the innate problem that he's having, which is that he can't get in. So, and it doesn't seem like Koma's fired a single projectile yet. So what's the point? Yeah, he's fired one. There's one bullet out of the chamber. Ooh. You're not going to exploit even then. And just in case you were just tuning in, folks, we are in our grand finals right now. Mm -hmm. Koma, was our, Koma was the winner going to this, and Hipster was our losers coming from the loser's bracket. And right now, okay. Hipster is, it looks like he might be getting ready to reset this bracket. So right. He is leading 2-0 to zero right now, and he's been showing some uh, phenomenal gameplay. I will say, though, that we were talking about how Koma changed from stick to hitbox. Right. I don't know if he's ever played Eltonum on a hitbox. At least not around here yet. Yeah. So it might be weird to... Yeah, see, there you hit the recovery of Persona. Uh, so it made him go away. There's just a... Ooh! Is that dog named Izzy? That's weird. Ozzy. Oh. <laughs> but yeah, I don't know. 
you always got something coming at you, so I guess you can't really fire bullets. But even then, if that was the case, then why didn't you just stake with... Okay, whatever, I'll let you do what you want, and that's it. That is a bracket that reset. Is a bracket reset. Ooh. And, okay, so... Look at Coma quickly Googling, what does this character do? And, and a nice pro tip that people are saying in chat, that the book reflector, it can't reflect Eltum's charge shots, the ones that bounce. Oh. So if if Coma can learn That's that information... Doing. If Coma oh, can learn no, that going information back to now... Batista. Oh, Peter's like, nope, I can't do it, nope. Whatever. I haven't practiced on stick with... I mean, I haven't practiced on hitbox with that character, so... How much is a hitbox? I'm going to try and get one now. They're like 200 bucks. Why uh, would you want to get one? I don't know. I've been seeing people do it. If, if, if you're just Listen. like... It, it, make, it makes hard things easy and easy things hard. I already can't do the hard things, so I'm just like, all right. <laughs> Might as well make it easier. <laughs> All right, so we're seeing some some more nice, aggressive play, uh, gameplay from Koma right now. But then again, you see Ozzy come out of the woodwork and just get that spacing, putting him in Hipster's favor. Yeah. Uh, I, I really think that it's a good idea for Koma to stick with Batista. But now he, I can kind of see him second-guessing himself and just being doubtful of his abilities. And that's really what kills you. You know, hesitation is a real big killer. Um... And you see Koma is really like playing off the back foot, you know, he's really not being as aggressive as he can be. He's saying, how do I get rid of the stupid dinosaur? <laughs> oh, nice. Force function right into it. Batista. So, Batista always got this grid meter. Yeah. Oh, wow, that yeah. hurt. The, the, like I said, when you that shatter grid, the shield. That hole, that's so much damage. That was like, fun. Like, listen. Koma, if you're watching this, you just gotta deal with this. You you have to deal with this because you're capable of beating him. You just gotta be. You just gotta pick your moment smart. smart. It's also not helpful to like figure this on in out in a tournament situation mm. on the fly with a character that you do not know what they do. I, I guarantee you, at least about four people after this tournament will be going home and laughing against chaos for a bit. Just yeah. <laughs> because if he comes in here and just sweeps us all, there's another character. Yeah. Have to How does that up. look for us? This is. It, it looks like we need to have more, a bit more variety when it comes to character character picks. Uh, it down here. never hurts. But now is the big opportunity. Grid broken. Chaos. Coma's going in with his Batista. That was a beautiful side switch. I didn't even see that. And yes, see, see Coma. Oh, mm. see, that's what I think they're going for. They're not going for that. They're going for the throw. See, we've hit him twice already mm. with the assault after the throw fake. And now, Koma, he's got his eye on the clock. He knows what's happening. Oh, he's got, oh so right now, all they come to do is to sit there and play defensively five, right now. Four. And, and let all you got to do is bail off. Bail off. And then, yeah. He doesn't want to. He, just, he doesn't have to do anything. But, yeah, I mean, it was the last round. So, okay. So, finally, into the reset bracket. Now that it is uh, one bracket to one bracket, like whatever you would call it. <laughs> one bracket to one bracket. And anyway, now that we're the reset bracket, mm -hmm. Koma finally puts one on the board. Yes, it does. It was 0 3 in the grand finals. Now he's in the loser's bracket. He's really got to play. He's got his back against the wall. So someone in chat is saying that they build a hitbox out of a VCR. I need to see this. Oh, you can build. These people got lots of technical knowledge, real crazy stuff. You've seen people build like hitboxes. Um, the ones that I saw on the left side, that if you go to tournaments, there's still some weird stuff. I saw one that was like on the left side was like a Saturn controller, and on the right side was like a keyboard. It what? was like weird. It was so weird. Maybe it was mixed up the other way around. It was weird. I saw some weird controllers. There was some guy, uh, I think it was CEO Taku mm -hmm. a couple years ago. He actually uh, was doing, I think it was Dengeki. He was, anyway, he ended some fighting game with a guitar three, with a, no. A rock band, like guitar or, or piano controller. What? Yeah, piano. That's what it was. It was a piano controller. That's wow. You know, I'll definitely give him. I'll definitely give him props yeah. for creativity and being able to actually perform well. And then we get hey, the super. Word. Oh, oh, but not, not enough, enough to finish. And see now, this is kind of like that, that hero mentality that everyone needs. Is you know. When your back's against the wall oh and you boy. got knocked down to it. There oh, you go. Oh, flash kick. The there we go. Chain shift to flash kick. Chain shift to the flash kick. Ooh. Smiles all around. Hilarious. Like That's I, a sign of a good player. Yes. It's just random uh, DPS. <laughs> I get it. I get it. 
Like, I definitely thought we were going to see Chaos come back from the Jaws defeat. Like, just that inner strength out of Don't nowhere. Do, yeah, right. <laughs> and then we got dive kick. I mean, we got jump, flash, uh, kick. flash kick. Flash kick to the face. Yeah, the opposite direction. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Again, he gets, so hard to approach. Gets that reflector, gets the bounce off, and converts off of that, but then drops the combo. But he's still applying the pressure with Azu. Yeah, we're seeing a lot of shielding, so it's not like it's really likely that Oma's ever going to lose the grid war. Ah, see, as soon as he came out, just got knocked away. Okay, interesting. God, that's so plus. Jesus Christ. Oh, my goodness. Oh, oh. Okay. And see, uh, Hitster can't use that Chaos Staple of like the Reflector mm -hmm. because his opponent's actually too close. It doesn't hit until it's like, uh, now it'll hit, but it only hits like a couple character lengths away. Mm -hmm. I think those are really interesting normals. The fact that you have to plan out where you're... Oh, that was a beautiful block on the overhead, but Very somehow nice. gets hit by the follow-up. What? Wasn't expecting it at all. Yeah, you can't do it twice, though. Now you can just hold back because you win. Good job, Koma. Hold back. See? Someone, right. someone clapped. Someone clapped and said, yeah, you did it, Koma. <laughs> Batista, I mean, not Batista, Koma, he's learning, like, that that quick side that, that quick side from yeah. him Googling just some things he can do and his adaptability. <laughs> I, I, I guarantee what does you, his character he, do? He, he Googled something because this is a complete 180 because Hipster definitely sweeped Koma in the first three matches, and now yeah. Koma is coming back, bringing this 0-2. to two. But it, it really was the fact that Batista, I mean, not Batista, Koma really just wasn't used to, like, not being able to be aggressive. And now okay. I think he's kind of learned that he can't always be aggressive or lock down his opponent the way he has been doing to other people and other right. players and other characters. Uh, yeah, just like shoot a laser out now. Come on, man. Oh, well, it was a great dodge through the just, projectile. Just all like very anime-esque. Just yeah. force functioning through the sphere, past the spheres. Very nice. Little girls with swords? Also very typical <laughs> of anime. <laughs> Facts. The biggest facts ever. Sword girls also typical of anime. Characters holding their glasses like that also anime. <laughs> that there, there's that ex has a long charge before it actually hits. Very nice overhead from Koma to get that opening. Ooh, sending Ozzy so, away. I think this plan is actually working in Koma's favor and against Hitchster because he spent so long trying to open up Batista that by the time, uh, that usually by the time that, you know, we're all getting very close to the like, timeouts, that was 15 seconds left we had on the clock. Um, yeah, that he really doesn't have a lot of time to make that comeback. Hitster is all about doing these random hits, you know, catching your opponent with like a, and, you know, not to say that Hitster hasn't pulled out the combos, but mm -hmm. most of his damage comes from like two or three hits, or at least two or three different moves. See? Yeah, you're right. Most of, like, those are what it is. When Batista is either trying to approach him or whatever, mm -hmm. man, people must really not like chaos. I hear like, a couple of like, woo, in the back every time he gets hit. Um, and yeah, he, like I said, he does have those combos, but a lot, a lot of it is just when he punches Batista for trying to get in. Ooh, there we go. With okay, that good stuff. That was a big, big yeah, chunk. Oh, that was a great. Oh, but this Koma doesn't capitalize off the fact that this. Oh, oh this is punishable. it. People, oh, wait, what is Koma doing? He's dropping things too much. Just, you can never say this is it. He's being a bit too just. And what are you going to do? At least you didn't flash kick. Oh, oh he got DP'd. Oh. And he got hit on the back end. Watch the what, situational awareness. You got to watch out for it. Just do. Oh, you got it. Change. Okay, okay. Yeah. Okay, so what are you going to do right now, Koma? Laser? What is it? Laser? Oh, no, do? he's charging just, back. You better just... just and then he gets <laughs> tailed in the face. Oh, my goodness. He was waiting for it. Yeah. Oh. But time was running down, so... Yeah. Man, real rough. Uh, so whenever another easy way to see it is you have under the point counter you have the as he meter i guess whenever that thing is red that's when if you hit the persona it'll go away okay see that's when it's attacking i'm learning Ooh. i didn't google it I'm just taking educated guesses, so this might all be incorrect. Ed ed edu educate, I mean, educated guesses from watching the matchup like maybe right. seven times. Okay, lasers. Yeah, and 
Oh, interesting. Okay, I managed to even get the Persona out. Ooh, very oh. nice grid break. Now, this is going to definitely put Koma at a nice advantage. Just try to apply the pressure, apply the damage, and get this guy into the corner and just mix to death. And Ooh, punish that oh, bail off. There you go no. again. Like, but he drops it. Ooh. But he gets the but overhead. He gets the exact same thing. The exact same grid break. It's happening. <laughs> I like the pressure that he's putting. Oh, okay, now this he's, is... Oh, he's able to get the flexor off the force function, bouncing Como away to get some breathing room, and then to capitalize and win that nice. game. Okay, Ooh. so Koma, look at that sigh of disgust on uh, Koma's face. What he wanted... He was almost there. He really wanted it to be over. He said, man, I was one round away, and almost this tournament would have been mine. Ugh. Every point that Hitchner puts on the board is one more that Koma... Like, one more drop of sweat on Koma's forehead. Mm -hmm. He's getting that much closer to losing. He says, I want to be able to eat today. Please. <laughs> I want that free lunch. Like, uh, Koma is definitely doing a very good job starting, and his mid game is also very good. It's just, it's just his his ending. He's he's getting too many drops for that end. Like he's it's been twice now that he's been able to punish uh, Hipster's veil his veil off, and he's just not able to finish. Right. And it was, or and then not to mention that, but he's also had like the uh, the throw fakes, and then he'll land with the overhead, mm -hmm. and then nothing will come out. You know, he'll he'll do the uh, the assault A, but then nothing else. And then we're getting back into the same old tired sort of assaulting, yeah. and then forgetting and that Ozzy's behind. Man, I would just let. Listen, what? What, do you, Homo, what are you doing? You have this huge life lead. At one point, it must have been at least like uh, like four thousand over his opponent. Mm -hmm. You could just sit back. Just sit back, the life lead. Make uh, him come to you, and then you get mixed into oblivion. Because you don't know what this character does. Okay. All right, good job. All right, very now nice, Dassy. No, you don't get a combo. Because he was kind of in the air, so I guess he felt weird. Tries to go from setups, apply some pressure, goes and with the overhead. Again. Grid breaks, very nice. We're seeing some things, we're seeing some uh, repeat things here, but he's able to try and. Let's see what he can do this time. He's, he's got him in the corner, applying pressure. He's got him below half health now. Close the throw. grab. Yeah, and there's no reason for Koma to stop with this pressure. Mm -mm, oh, good use of the very EX. Nice. There you go. Kong, there we go. Oh, that wasn't EX. I lied. But whatever it was, it was still a good. Yeah. It was still a good nice decision for Koma. And it, it is now game point for Koma right yeah, now. Let's tournament make sure he, point. In fact. Tournament point. Let's make sure he keeps his cool. And I swear, if if Hipster veils off again yeah. and Koma punishes and drops, I will cry. Now it's just the underdog, so I want to see him. <laughs> yeah, you hear that, Koma? I'm changing my vote. I thought I, I, you got knocked down to loser, so I was rooting for you, but now you're going to win. And... Oh, Ooh, hits, hits eyes. Ooh, and very nice grab for all bounce. And what really is killing Aji, it, uh, I don't know why I said that. The hitster. Oh, this could is, be it. That might be it. You got 200%. No. Ooh, and throw. There. Okay. A, a tiny bit anticlimactic, folks. Look at but that. People are clapping. He gets it. People are so mad at Hitster. <laughs> Ooh. So mad. He said, finally. That they man said, is out of there. Everyone's clapping. I mean, he was definitely. Nah, I'm kidding. It was for, because it was a good match. 